So we're very happy that we're able to pass data. So we click, we go to the details page or screen, and we're passing the avatar, or in this case, the movie title. Okay, so we can go back. Now this going back here, you can see this is a button and some of your phones may have a back button, right? But you can see uh, newer phones nowadays, they don't really have these physical back buttons. In fact, mine doesn't really have that. The reason why I have it here is because I'm running this software that is mirroring my phone. So it just gives this back home buttons. So, and also on top of that, you can see that we have this top bar here, yeah, which allows us to put all sorts of things. So if you click here, notice we don't have that there. It would be nice to have our top bar there as well. But before that, let's understand how would we go back to the main screen, in this case home, without hitting the back button. So let's start small. So inside of our detail screen, right after the text, I can just go ahead and say button, just create a simple button, right? And then we have the on click given, can get rid of that. And then inside here, inside of our button, we're going to put a text, right? Kind of some kind of a label to say what this button is supposed to do, right? So some kind of a label. So I'm going to say here, go back like this. Let's just put some spacer, a spacer here. I want the modifier height such let's give it about 23 dp let's go ahead and import dp as such okay very good so let's go ahead and run again okay let's go to 300 you can see there is that back button all right nice now what is that we want to do well we just want to go back to the previous uh screen in this case previous composable now, because the way navigation works is that we do have a stack that happens as we navigate. So when we go from our main screen here, our uh, home screen, this is the first item on stack. And we click, we go to this one, then we, now this is the one on top of the first stack, right? On top of the first item in our stack. To go back, that means we have to pop the screen, which is on top of the stack right now. That way, then we can go to the previous item on the stack. So what do we do in our own click here? It's very simple now. Remember, this is the beauty. That's why we passed the nav controller all along. Ah, so this nav controller here, I can use it. I can say nav controller, because again, it controls everything. It knows what needs to be done, and it directs everything, right? We can say nav controller. Look at this again, dot. I can say pop back or I can navigate again. Remember this, right? So what I want, I just gonna say, I'm just gonna pop back stack. That's all. If I run Harry Potter, go back, notice we go back. All right, very good.